Pens are being put to paper, and four Chinook high school students are moving on from high school to enter the big times and university sports careers. Brantley Saar has been wrestling since he was in grade 8, and now he's joining the University of Calgary U Sports program. Saar says that he's excited to join the Dinos team, even though he hasn't faced another wrestler in a year due to the pandemic. It's been a lot of just working on anything I can uh, by myself and just there's been a couple virtual camps that I've attended to try and just get something out of it but yeah it's definitely tough when you can't do a contact sport. Angelina Ellis Toddington will be joining SAR at the UFC for wrestling as well. She says that it was the first place she wanted to go for university. Well, they have the best woman in the country and it's super exciting. Um, I started wrestling around grade four mostly with my siblings because there wasn't really any other elementary kids. And then it started more in grade six and kind of just picked up every year from there. T.L. Hagel will be making her way to Brandon University to play volleyball for the U Sports program. And she says that the sport of volleyball was instilled into her at a young age. My parents both played volleyball for a really long time. Like ever since I was really little, I've always been at the gyms and, you know, catching balls for my parents when they were serving and stuff like that. So, yeah, I started really young and... Volleyball, like, volleyball's my entire life. I don't know who I'd be without volleyball. It's taught me so many life lessons, teamwork, you know, how to work hard, how to persevere. And so I just can't even thank volleyball enough for all it's done for me in my life. Abby Froome rounds out the list of athletes from Chinook High School, and she'll be going to the Marion University Sports Program in Wisconsin, where she will be playing golf. Froome says that her strongest skill set in golf is her driver shot, where she can launch the ball up to 250 yards. I've been keeping track of the scores with the girls that I'll be playing with and I seem to be already in that area so I feel like I shouldn't um, lack the skills. For Bridge City News, I'm Micah Quinn.